Hello guys, today in this video I will show you how you can upload a multiple images and show the preview of these images. So here I will write a custom code and I will explain how the code is work. So let's see an example. So first of all I will go to the Visual Studio code and here I will write an image tag and I will bind the source property of this image. So we use square bracket to bind so square bracket source equals and the variable name is URL and close. So when I will upload any images, then the image will be uh, added into the source property. So uh, we use square bracket to bind this source property. And when I will upload a multiple image, then the source property will be increased one by one. So to increase one by one, so here I will write a ng for loop. So ng for equals to inverted comma and let let we want to increase this source property so url variable for and url is variable url is variable will be looped one by one so now i will copy this url is variable and in the ts file i will scroll the page and here is the ng on it and below the ng on in it i will paste this url is variable and equals to array I use URL's variable as the array because in the source property here will be added multiple images. So I use this URL as a array. And now here I will let a be attack to break this line and now I will create a input type file to upload image and here I will upload multiple image. So I will let the attribute multiple multiple attribute used to upload multiple image and now here parenthesis and I will write a change function because when we upload image this time I, we write a change function so inverted comma and the function name is on select and parenthesis you can write any name of this function and in the javascript and jquery to separate this event we use this keyword but angular provide us dollar even instead of this keyword and now i will copy this on select and here i will paste so in this on select function we pass dollar even to separate this event so now in the ts file in this on select function we have to pass up another parameter so i will write the parameter name is e Here I will write an if condition. So if e is the parameter dot target to separate this event to e dot target dot files. Files is the inbuilt of JavaScript method. So we use files method to get the DOM property of input type file. So now I will write a for loop because it will be added multiple images. So I write at the for loop so for late i equals to 0 i less than file dot length and i plus plus so that means the image will be uploaded up to file dot length and file is the property of input type file so we use here files so that means we can get the file property because we use file to get the property of input type file so now we get the file property so file dot i plus plus and now here i will create an object file reader so where reader equals to this is the variable reader variable and i will create a new file leader object so this object will be readed our uploaded files and reader dot read as data url so read as data url will be read url our uh, our target files so
e dot target dot files square bracket i i is the this i variable and now reader dot on load equals to here I have to write another parameter so I will write events parameter and events type is any because we can upload text file image file etc so events type is any And this is the arrow function. So I used here arrow function. Arrow function is then ECMAScript 6. This is the new JavaScript function. So now this dot this URL variable dot push. So I will push the our target images into the urls variable so i'll copy this events dot target dot result result is in the in is the inbuilt of javascript method to get result now i'll press ctrl s to save and in the html file i will press ctrl s to save also and now I will go to the browser and here now I will upload multiple image so I will press control to select multiple image and open so you can see here is the two images is uploaded but it's appeared as a big size so I will set the height attribute height 100 now let's see so now if i upload multiple images so you can see it's added two images so hope this video is helpful for you and if you want to get more this type of angular videos so then please subscribe and press the notification bell icon also